After driving through many paddocks across the farm, we finally found some magpies in the range. Would you look at that? It's a shot of magpie. And he's five deer over. I'm a bit lost for words, really. Dropped a shot of magpie here. Just here. And then, as we stopped, I saw five deer just over there. And yeah, one like young stag, eight pointer, and four hinds. Well, I don't know, maybe two hinds and two yearlings, but holy shit, that's cool. They've gone now, but. We knew there were deer down here. I didn't know they were living that close to the house. No, they're only 300 metres away. Maybe not even, but that's bloody cool. Yeah, hopefully we can get a few more rabbits and magpies and, well, anything really today and tomorrow. And then, yeah, that's a bloody cool sight though. We haven't been very successful on the magpie front this afternoon, but... Uh, we've just come into the shed now and we're going to hopefully get a couple of pigeons or a couple of starlings or something because we only got one magpie. We did see those five deer though so that was pretty cool. So yeah, hopefully we can get something now before it gets too dark. Also, we might be going for a rabbit night shoot tonight, so not sure we might get a few videos in. Me and Jock just woke up and Dad just came and told us that there's a big stag up the hill somewhere. Um, yeah, it's the same one that we saw last night. He's an absolute cracker of a stag, so yeah, hopefully we can go find him. And he's better than anything I've shot, so it'd be awesome if I can get him. See what happens. Well, um, I just shot my best tag. Um, uh, the first shot wasn't very good. I was shaking a lot, but we just got up to it. It took a while, but I just shot him in the back of the neck. So, yeah, he's just down right here. He's a good tag. Well, I just shot my personal best tag. Uh, he's a ripper looking for it. Now, if you heard that last back time, he would have been an awesome 12, but I'm not complaining. He's Real skinny and still all rusted up from the war. Um, you had to give him two shots because I was a bit shaky on that first shot, but I'm over the moon. Uh, had a bit of a sleeping this morning, but 
nah, it was, it's awesome. I'm so stoked. <laughs> As you would have seen a small enough shot, my best sag. He is an absolute ripper. I'm stoked with him. Um, yeah, me and Jock are just going to go off now and try and shoot some more magpies. Um, we're not going to shoot over at the shed for pigeons and starlings today because uh, it's only a couple weeks to duck shooting and we don't want to scare the ducks off. So, yeah, hopefully we can get a few more magpies. We only got one yesterday. Uh, we might go down to Tony's again and then just drive around ours and try and shoot a few. See what happens, really. Five of the hairs we shot last night, not too bad. We've just gutted all the hairs and Jock's just gonna cut the head and feet off because it's just dog tucker. And I'm gonna go cut the head off my stag. Although we weren't very successful small game hunting, we were well over the moon with my big stag was short. Although he was only about five years old, I'm still so stoked for him. Cheers for watching his video. Like and subscribe if you like what you're seeing. Cheers.